Hello gorgeous souls. My name is Rochelle and welcome back. Welcome to the DIY Affiliates and Collectives Soul Journey. I'd like to say a special welcome to all of my new subscribers and everybody who is with me on this life journey where we talk about awakening, awakening to a twin flame journey, the algorithm for manifesting a desired outcome, energies, frequencies, and chakras. In this video, it's broken down into three parts. The first part is the free chakra uh, frequencies, the Sofa Show Frequencies Healing, self-healing app. The second part is the auric field, the subtle energy bodies featuring the mental body, the chakras, and the prana life force. And the third part is the guided solar plexus chakra activation meditation by the Brain Education TV. Before we get to the video, if you are looking for knowledge about the six stages of awakening or the twin flame journey, then look to the top right and find a playlist and you can choose the right video for you. And please take a moment to subscribe to my channel for more updated content. I give you just the facts. Jump in the video. Part 1. Find this link in the description to download this app, the Sofa Show Frequencies Healing Self-Healing app from the Google Play Store or you can also find it at the Apple's iOS store. You can use this as a premium user or you can use the free version which will contain ads. Install this app then open it up. When the app is opened up you will see this screen. You can become a premium user or you will see ads. Choose the chakra power pack. Choose the gold icon which is the, the Manipura solar plexus chakra. This will give you the solar plexus chakra music in which you can choose different sounds and natures, the timer, an ohm chant, the frequency volume indicator, the pranayama breathing, or use binaural beats for meditation and sleep with a headset. If you are not used to listening to the Sofa Show frequency, use the, the, fr the frequency volume indicator and turn it down so there is less frequency until your brain gets used to it. The solar plexus is located in this area of the body. Part 2. Chakras, the auric field, the subtle energy body system, prana, the life force, the third energy body, the mental body. We are not just physical bodies. There is a pulsing electromagnetic energy field that connects us and putting the aura or the auric field. The aura is the electromagnetic field of energy that extends all around the body, expanding about four to five feet away from the body in an average healthy body. This is an energy source field that interacts with our physical body by flowing through spirals of energy centers located in specific places in the body. The spiral energy centers are known as chakras. This is a Sanskrit word meaning wheels of light. There are seven main chakras, plus a number of smaller ones that interact with our body's ductless and endocrine glands and lymphatic system. By feeding in the good energy and disposing or getting rid of unwanted energy, this helps to regulate the energy as it flows in and around and through your body. So this is important to our health because we want to prevent illness or disease. So we need to learn how to nourish our chakras and understand what is this energy pulsing through the body. Have you heard of the word prana? What is it and what does it mean? We get most of our sustenance from the Mother Earth, from the air we breathe, the water we drink, and the food that we eat. This all creates prana, which is a vital life force, life force that can be absorbed into your body through the chakras. When your physical body is fully in harmony with life, 
a larger central line of energy called the Shushumna Hara line extends down through the auric field right into the Earth's core. This is called the umbilical cord to Mother Earth. So now what is this energy which is the life source of the universe? Prana. Prana is an energy that pulses through the body along a network of subtle body channels. Similar to the nervous system, the channels or nadis, meaning pathways of the subtle body, connect, form and mind and act as a conduit for this prana energy. If you think of the chakra as bioenergy that flows in and around our body, our body is the subtle energy. Sometimes this is referred to as layers of the auric field or the subtle energy bodies of the aura. The human being's colorful energy field is shaped like an egg or an oval, a light of different colors. Each color is associated with one of the seven chakras. Some people may say it is cocoon shaped. This surrounds the body and it is made of seven layers of subtle energy blending together. The colors vary from all the colors of the chakras plus darker clouds of colors. Generally, the energy becomes faster and finer as it moves away from the physical body, and some people call this the luminous auric field. By looking at a person's aura, you can see the level of spirituality. The more advanced a person is, the lighter the colors are. You can see these lighter colors in the auric source field. Mentioned subtle energy. What is it? First, let's learn about the subtle energy system of the body. The subtle energy system has three components. The meridians, the chakras, and the aura. Meridians or nadis are pathways in which energy travels within our tissues that runs, this runs on each side of the body. There are 12 major meridians, the stomach, the spleen, the small intestine, large intestine, heart, lung, bladder, kidney, percardian, triple warmer, meridian, gallbladder. And each, each side, it mirrors the other side. And each meridian is correlated to an internal organ. So where does this subtle energy come from? This concept comes from a collective of people who accept that the human being has the ability to see or hear forces that are energy pulsing through the body that cannot be measured physically. What is this vital life force? This is the prana that can be absorbed into your body through the chakras. Prana is an energy that pulses through the body along a network of subtle body channels, similar to the central nervous system. The channels of the subtle body or natus connect form and mind and act as a conduit for prana energy. We have talked about the subtle energy system. This includes the seven energy bodies. This video, we are talking about the third energy body, which is called the mental body. This is connected to the solar plexus chakra. The mental energy body, this is the uh, layer of the auric source field, and this is connected to the Manipura solar plexus chakra. The Manipura, and this concerns the mental concepts of our world. You will find the energy is starting to pulsate faster and at a finer level. And it will even pulsate faster and finer if your mind is more active and in the receiving mode. The mental body size varies greatly from 5 centimeters to 30 centimeters. The average size ranges from 10 to 20 centimeters. The mental body connects to the solar plexus chakra. Part 3. following meditation will help you to unblock the solar plexus chakra for increased energy, clarity of mind, awareness, inner peace, more creativity, open to deep spiritual experiences and spiritual enlightenment. Part three is a guided meditation which will help to activate your solar plexus chakra done by the 
Brain Education TV. Before you begin the meditation, go to your app, The Sofa Show Frequencies Healing, and open it up so that you have the Manipura Solar Plexus music on and turn the volume down so you can still hear the meditation. Enjoy the meditation. Hello, Earth citizens. In this video, I will do a 10 minute routine on emotional chakra release. So in this video, we're going to be focusing on the solar plexus chakra, the third chakra right here. So it's located right under your rib cage, kind of in that dip right underneath. And this chakra holds your self-confidence, your willpower, your decision-making power, and also stress and emotions. So if you're very stressed, if you, you know, need more self-confidence, more willpower, this chakra may be a little bit blocked. So in this video, we're going to release it with a few simple exercises. All right, let's begin. So first exercise, put your feet shoulder width apart and place your hands like this at your sides. And we're going to twist. Twist your lower body. Don't move your upper body, your head, nothing, just your lower body, your lower half. We can start out a little bit slowly, but for most people, when they start twisting here, they feel some sharp pains, sharp pains around the solar plexus area. So what you do is you breathe in deeply and exhale. Exhale out the tension in your solar plexus. Imagine you're shaking out all the stress and tension here in this area. Imagine there's a ball here and you're shaking it, shaking it off. You don't have to go too strongly. You don't have to shake too strongly, but just twist and breathe in and exhale out. and relax your shoulders. Make sure you're not like this. Relax your shoulders, drop them down. And keep twisting. This is also good for your gut, for your organs, to move them around, give them a little bit of energy, release any tension in your gut area as well. Take a deep breath in and exhale out keep twisting we'll do this for one more minute keep breathing out Deep breath in and exhale. Deep breath in and exhale. And smile. Deep breath in and exhale. You could be feeling hot. You could be feeling a lot of heat right now. I'm feeling heat all over my body. Just from this simple twisting, I feel sweaty and hot. Just a little bit longer. Breathe in. And exhale. Breathe in. And exhale. All right, and stop. Whew. And rub this area clockwise. Massage this area. Now massage your entire abdomen. All right, now for the next exercise. Let's tap here. So 
find your solar plexus. It's in the dip under your rib cage. Even if you press, sometimes it could be a little painful. So tap, make two small light fists. And let's tap this area. Release the tension here. Don't tap too hard because you could feel a little winded if you tap too hard right here. Just tap gently with the intention of releasing tension in this chakra. Take a deep breath in and exhale. 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 Two more times, deep breath in and exhale. Deep breath in and exhale. All right, great job and stop. And now let's just shake out your body, shake out your shoulders. Bounce your knees up and down, shake out your arms, shake out your shoulders, shake your head, shake your knees, bounce your knees, and shake, 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 shake off the stress in your body. All right, great job. Now let's place our hands on our third chakra, our solar plexus chakra and send healing, loving energy to this chakra. And as you're sending this energy, say to yourself, I am confident. I have willpower. I am strong. I am confident. I have willpower. I am strong. I am stress free. All right, now sweep down, sweep down. So how do you feel? Do you feel less stress and tension in this area? If you still feel some, I would recommend doing more of the twisting. Twist more, maybe do it 10 more minutes, five more minutes, however long you could do it for, but that really helps to open up this area and open up this chakra. So I hope you feel better. Please write your comments and your experience. Thank you for being on this journey with me. And thank you for your continued support of this message and of this channel. Please leave a comment and tell us where you are on your journey. And is there a specific video you would like to see me create with illustrations? I read all my comments. Looking forward to hanging out with you in the next video.